Beware of illegal video cassettes. Check whether this video cassette carries a genuine label hologram. Video piracy is a crime. Do not accept it. Demand a genuine cassette from your video store. Poor quality illegal video cassettes reduce your viewing pleasure and jeopardize future film production. When in doubt, telephone the Federation Against Copyright Theft. Fact on 0181 568 6646. Or in the case of the Republic of Ireland, 01 6777 071. When you rent or buy a video, you need to know that the film you choose is suitable for the audience at home. To help you understand what the film is like, you can look at the certificate it has been given. This film has been classified PG. This stands for parental guidance and means that parents may wish to check the film before showing it to their children. If it's an action film, it might have some limited violence. If it's romantic, it might have some sexy scenes or very brief nudity. It might also contain some milder swear words. Video certificates are there to give you the chance to make the right choice. Thanks for listening. I'm off. Oh, I got that video Rebecca wanted. Only cost a fiver from that bloke down the market. Great. It's not even out yet. She'll love it. I know. See you later. Mm, see you. Okay. Bye now. I have the results from the overnight tracking. You know, it's not fair. I mean, every other president had all of the Russians to blame for everything. What do I got? For an unpopular president. Uh, the voters felt that your being alive or dead had no real bearing on their daily lives. It's time to give war a chance. Dead. Dead. What are we going to do for an enemy now? A riot between Americans and Canadians broke out last night. Now, with a little inspiration. All I said was Canadian beer sucks. Give me one week and I'll have Americans burning maple leaves. They'll create a cause worth fighting for. Is Canadian Prime Minister Clark McDonald a member of a satanic cult? Oh, that is stunning. Canadians are always screaming up a lot of ways to ruin our lives. The metric system for the love of God. Do not panic. I'm in complete control. There's a time to think. There's a time to act. And this gentleman... There's no time to think. Move up! Welcome to Canada. I'm your worst nightmare. I don't know what you're talking about. We got ways of making you pronounce the letter O. What we have here is a brave but misguided group of Americans who go right into Canada and kick some serious Canadian butt. Oh, Americans! Welcome to Ontario. Sportsman's paradise. <laughs> Isn't it, though? John Candy. You Canadians are so sneaky. Alan Alda. Surrender pronto. Or we'll level Toronto. Rhea Perlman. What does this look like to you? I never saw a white one that size. Kevin Pollack. When have you ever heard anyone say, honey, let's stay in and order some Canadian food? Rip Torn. I can't kill America's neighbors. I can't. Canadian bacon. From the director of Roger and Me. Yeah, All right, now how did you know that was a nuclear facility? Well, they tricked us on that one. That's a hospital. But it's a hell of a strike. <laughs> From Touchstone Pictures, they said it would never work. Mommy. Where are you off? A man who had no one. He's very unconventional. Adopting a child who had nothing. Hey, 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 you gotta test that on your wrist. Why? <laughs> but now, against all odds... How did you plan to send her to school? They're struggling to build a life. Are you her father? She adopted me out. And determined to become a family. Steve Martin. Remind me to cut that hole bigger. A simple twist of fate. Welcome, welcome, Camp Kipperman Campers! Yeah! 
Your time at summer camp is one you'll never forget. It's a camp tradition for the strong. That'd be us. Just screw with the weak. Welcome to camp, loser. Trust me, you're gonna love it. A time for meeting new friends. Welcome to the pickup. Introductions are in order. Uh. This is gonna be one swell summer, kid. Those gentlemen are girls. Our sole reason for living. Did you guys check out those dorks from the pig hut? But it's not all fun and games. You guys are the biggest bunch of slobs I've ever seen. <laughs> I hate this place. Well, it's about time. You mean I'm supposed to hate it? Mm -hmm. Give it another try. Welcome, welcome, ladies. Everybody, come on! Hey, 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 hey! Now this is a party! Let's destroy their lives. It's a fight for survival. Man, these guys think they can do whatever they want and get away with it. So what are we? Men or pigs? Pigs! It's time for revenge. And getting back as only a pig knows how. Time to bring home the bacon. Never before in all my worldly exploits have I witnessed such collective acts of swinery and hoggishness. We're pigs, which means we get meaner and fight harder. Oh, oh, it's the pigs! They're back! And they're mad! Ah! Ah! That was cool. I declare that the winner, the pigs from the oh! big yeah! oh! A pig's tail. Every pig has his day. Doesn't get any better this, guys. <laughs>
Robin Williams. Jumanji. It's a jungle in there. Try your hand at gliding. Or try your hand at gliding. Train in the morning. Train in the morning. Riding one day. Riding the next. Enjoy afternoon tea. Oh, afternoon tea. How about dining out? Or dining out? Come for the castles. Come for the castles. Stay for the drama.